Oh, that's a big fish. That's a big fish. Big fish, big fish. Oh, that's a nice one. Hey! Look at there. Oh, Hold them up. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, I got one on. I got one on. Hold it. There you go. What are you doing, Ruben? <laughs> Hi, this is uh, Cody Dunn, Cody Dunn Outdoor Adventures. I'm uh, taking the Ball High School kids, the Sam Mixon Memorial Ball High School Fishing Club. We're going over to Seawolf Park today. Going to go catch some fish and come by to see my buddy Derek Fortshop. And what, what else? Uh, Captain Chop. No, the Catch a Lot. Uh, Black Magic. Stacking meat. Stacking meat. <laughs> <Magic. I know. laughs> all, all the above. He got a lot of nicknames, huh? Yes, sir. That's right. But now we have a new venture. Not only are we in the zone fishing charters, we now have Gulf Coast Bait and Tackle located at 6127 Broadway Street. You can give us a phone call at 409 260 Bait. That again is 409 260 2248. We're here for all your bait needs. We have live shrimp, dead shrimp. Live crabs, we have offshore bait, rig bait. Lots of crab. Lots of crab. <laughs> right now, Lots we're sitting on about 200 pounds, so Ooh, all more you guys than anybody. want to hit this drum run, yeah. we got you here at Gulf Coast Bait Tackle. Hello. So what do you have going this on? Ain't my, this ain't my truck. Whose truck is that? This is my truck over here. <laughs> oh, I can smell it now. <laughs> Thanks, you probably can. <laughs> what do we have going on today, Tom? All right, we're at Seawolf Park today, and uh, we got the uh, Sam Mixon Ball High School Memorial Fishing Club coming out to fish. I think we're going to have a, a small group today because of baseball, so it'll probably be the girls and maybe a couple of the boys. But uh, we're here at Seawolf. There's a little bit of a trout bite going on here this every April. Uh, over here by this rock, you throw out, current's going this way, and you kind of walk your cork back and can get some trout doing that. So trying to put these kids on some trout, show them a different experience. And the world of Galveston saltwater fishing, you know, we've done, you know, down on the beach and 91st Street Fishing Pier. We've fished at Seawolf, uh, Seawolf Park before and then at Sea Scout. So, and then, you know, eventually we're going to be ending it up probably in the boat, you know, for the year-end tournament, I think. So. Oh, my gosh, look how big that is. You got them eyeing the bait. Hey, swing it around. Swing it over. Swing it over to me. There you go. Woo! Hit ribbon in the head with it. Croak or soap. <laughs> hey, what's that? What's that? that on the big rod. Yeah, really. I've got the big rod. Hey, Cody, so tell me your setup. What are you this fishing with? It's a slip cork, so you got a stopper up here. Uh huh. This though, you know, it's hard to throw if you got a five foot leader. So when you, you know, this stays down here, then when it hits the water, it comes slides up, and you can make it ten foot deep even. Okay, ten yeah. foot long. Yeah. So we've got. So a, you can fish ten feet deep. Uh, you got a split shot. That is your that is your court down here. Yeah. It's kind of old for being That's a high bad. school. <laughs> it's kind of old for being a high school fisherman. <laughs> Slow learn. Slow learn. <laughs> Hey, these are the sheepies, man. That's what I'm talking about. Well, how big is this? <laughs> 15 and a quarter? <laughs> huh? You got a ruler there? There we go. Right there on the front. There we go. 16. 16. Yeah, see? Thank you, ma'am. 16. There you go. See, I told you the spot was over here, Cody. I told you the spot was over here. Woo, that's a nice drag pull. Yeah, yeah. Nice sheepy. Oh, sheepy. There you go. Bring him to me. Bring him to me. Just like it. Eee, that's a nice one, bud. Hey, that's, yeah, that's a nice one. How would you? Be so grabby, man. What are you doing? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I got a percentage. So who 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 are these from? Dad Co. What do they do? 
They make fishing stuff, like fishing knives stuff. and pliers. Oh, okay. Right. There you go. They make the, the best knife and pliers in the world. The best knife and pliers okay. in the fishing okay. business. All right, look at there. Bam. Look at there. there. And Show me how they work. Demonstrate me. Demonstrate them on him. <laughs> How do those work? What are those work? Yeah, what are these? Open your mouth fish so he can show them. Yeah, yeah, oh, your mouth. <laughs> right there. Hold the fish up. He just, he just takes it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. <laughs> she said, oh, Lord. Yeah, here you go. Yeah, this is a good one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Where's your net? You got a net? You got it? Okay. Yeah. It's over there. Okay. I see it. It's behind him. The net's behind him. This yeah. Is oh Lord. Oh Lord. Come on. You think it's bigger than that last one? Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Oh, that's a big fish. Big fish. Big fish. Oh, that's a nice one. That is. Yay! Look at there. That is a good one. The boys just left. See that? You got to tell them when you see them tomorrow at school. Y'all missed it. You got to get out the pinkies. Yeah, look at there. That's a nice trout. Yeah, that's a nice, that's a nice trout. big one. I'm jealous. Oh my. Is that your biggest trout? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Personal best. Man, that's a good one. Yeah, that's hold a big it, one. it way out there. <laughs> there you go. There you go. What'd you think about that one? Was that a fun one? Yeah. Yeah? The big fighter, huh? Yeah. Hey, you ran with it. Come on with it. Oh, 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 oh. I'm trying to stay out the way. Net man, baby. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. That's a good one. Hey, damn, that's a nice horse. Oh, I got one on! I got one on! Here, hold it! There you go. <laughs> what are you doing, Ruben? <laughs> I got one on! I'm trying to record! <laughs> oh, somebody's lying! Oh, he's got a catfish! No, I'm just playing. <laughs> yeah, I was playing. Oh, he's gonna oh, flip him! Oh, that. flip a rooster! <laughs> Yeah, because that's my pole. <laughs> that's how I roll. <laughs> you don't care if he breaks my pole or not. Yeah, I don't care about your pole. <laughs> you got this. Nice good video. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's a double. Yeah. <laughs> Granger and them are going to be mad. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Granger. Y'all left at the wrong time, Granger. You left too early. Too early. <laughs> Woo! Get him! Oh, miss. Go to the left side. Okay, then go back to my back. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. There you go. Woo! Yeah. I was holding my breath the whole time. That's a nice fillet. Awesome. That's awesome. That's a big one. Yeah. Good one. Well, that's going to do it today. You know what? I had a, a lot of fun out there uh, fishing with the kiddos. Unfortunately, left, you know, a, unfortunately, a few of them left a little early before we started getting into the trout. And uh, like Cody said, there was a uh, baseball game going on, a baseball tournament going on. So some of the kids that normally come out, some of the teenagers that normally come out, weren't able to come out because they had other obligations so um it was great it's always great to uh to be involved in the community i love coming out and uh, helping helping captain cody uh with his nonprofit. and uh, i really enjoy coming out with these uh with these high school kids and and with the fishing club you know it's a unfortunately it's a very unfortunate a senseless act it's a memorial fishing club and uh you know, my heart goes out to the parents, the family members, friends, teachers, everybody in the community that was affected by such a senseless, senseless act. Um, 
from you know from my heart I wouldn't know what to do with myself if I if I lost my son at uh, such a young age or lost my son at all but especially at such a young age um, really senseless so uh, my heart goes out to uh, the friends and family parents of uh, of these kiddos and um, but you know what we we it's starting to heat up a little bit uh, out there at Sea Wolf Park, you know, we caught some nice trout, saw some other people fishing around us, and they caught some nice trout too, and kind of had fun, you know, just being outdoors and uh, and watching the kids have a good time, and watching uh, Hannah, you know, get into some of the fish and be able to pull a nice, nice big speck out. Um, just a great day, just a great day, great thing to be part of. If you want to help support Captain Cody's nonprofit, his information is below. So he can be able to continue to do stuff like this in the, in the fishing community and be able to continue to give back. And I love coming out. I mean, um, there's nothing more that nothing more that warms my heart than uh, being able to come out and watching the people smile and enjoy catching fish. Whether it's somebody that's physically challenged or, you know, maybe somebody that, that that's lost a friend and uh, feels a little closer by doing something that he enjoyed and, and, and he loves doing. Um, but hey guys, uh, don't forget, subscribe to the channel, like the video, leave a comment, all that stuff really helps the channel out tremendously. And until next time, hopefully you catch us hooking up, and hopefully real soon you'll see us out there with the kiddos. We're going to try to get the, get the, get the teens on some boats, and, um, kind of a little end of the year, go out with the bang, and, uh, end of the year fishing club, and get out and do a little competition on some boats, so, um, yeah. Hope you enjoy your day. Thanks. Man.